and gets underneath for the reverse dunk. Holmes with a double-double, 33 points, 12 rebounds. On the board we go. Flyers sort of their 10th straight win, 72-62 over Duquesne. UD now 13-2 overall, 3-0 in the Atlantic 10. They will host St. Louis at sold-out UD Arena coming up on Tuesday night. Wright State and Youngstown State began the evening tied for second place in the Horizon League. The Raiders in, at YSU this evening to take on the Penguins. Scott Nagy's team going for their fourth straight win. First half, Trey Calvin off the dribble, puts up the rainbow fadeaway, and he sinks it. Later, it's Calvin again this time. Check out the spin move, and he strokes in two more. Raiders up by two when Wright State goes inside out. A.J. Braun to Logan Woods, and the redshirt freshman drains the three. A.J. Braun working at the paint here, up with the right hand and in, plus the foul. And Wright State was up by two at the break. Second half, Alex Hubricks with two defenders on him, finds space and knocks down the fadeaway jumper. Later, it's the Raiders on the run. The pass goes down low to Brandon Knoll. And that bucket put Wright State up by seven, but it was all Penguins after that. On the board, Youngstown State pulls away late, 81 to 71, your final in that one. To the high school hardwood, a big game in the G-Walk tonight between Springboro and Beaver Creek. The Panthers began the evening a half game behind the Beavers for second place to Ed Zink Fieldhouse. Both teams seeking.